Hello everyone in Cyber World, welcome back to another video. I'm Richard. And I'm Jennifer, and this is our channel we call Poor Man's DIY. Our hallway light went out and we installed a new one. It still didn't work, and we found out it was the switch. So this video we're going to show you how we installed the light and the switch. Before we get into that, uh, we're going to have you read this disclaimer first.
Now, we're going to be matching these up. I've already put in the, the uh, neutral line here and connected that, but I'm going to show you how I do this. Uh, make sure you have your lines set up. You know, this is the uh, live wire. This is, the, in other words, the power that's coming in from the, the circuit breaker. This is the load line. Uh, this is where it's going to go to the light switch itself. Okay, so how I do this is to get it started, a little pinch on here, a little twist to combine these two together. Oh. A little stronger hold this way. Get a cap and twist it and make it tight. Now, a lot of people will leave it at this. Um, what I like to do, I learned this once a long time ago, was keep twisting it so that the wires back here start twisting them, uh, wrapping around each other. What this will do is make it less likely that one of these will fall out. Now, since I mentioned I'm not a uh, electrician or professional on this one here, just as a triple security measure to make sure nothing falls out, I want to hold everything in place, I use electrical tape um, just to make myself feel even better. All right, so we're going to do that for the ground and the out and we should be good. We have everything connected. We're going to tuck that in the wall in the box and fill that up there. All right, now let's put the plate on. Now, I uh, thought I was going to test the, the lights out first to make sure that was the problem, and uh, I obviously didn't do a good job, but it's okay. What I have found, several of these smart switches that we purchased uh, several years back were new to the industry at the time, and one by one, they have been going out, so it didn't really matter that uh, we replaced both the light and the switch. I know the switch was going to go at some point, and I had some spares, so it worked out really well. Um, obviously, I didn't get into the instructions on how to set up the smart uh, switch itself. Uh, that's a different video. I think I put a link on, on one for that we did in the past. This was much more just to show you how to wire it and that it's not that difficult to wire up lighting and the switch. Next week's video, we received a cute little laser that we're going to test out and see how that goes. So until then, bye-bye.